Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing something a little different. I know a lot of you guys probably wanted to know about my faux locks. I have been wearing these faux locks for a couple weeks now and I wanted to show you guys how I maintenance them. They are very easy to maintenance, but I just wanted to share with you guys some of the tips and um, things that I do to maintenance my hair using the Head & Shoulders Royal Oils Collection. This collection was developed by Head & Shoulders to um, cater to African American women and our hair texture we often deal with dry scalp I know I have really bad dry scalp so these products are formulated specifically for dry scalp itchy scalp type issues because healthy hair starts at the root so you got to take care of your scalp so that's what these products are for you can find these products at family dollar I'll put a link in the description box where you can find them but you can go to your local family dollar and find them as well so the whole purpose of having a protective stylist so that I can maintenance my scalp while the rest of my hair is chilling underneath these locks I just really wanted to share with you guys what I do before I take them out because it's almost time for them to go okay my hair is covered by the locks there are braids underneath each lock these locks are by uh, Bobby Boss, I believe. Bomba Soul Locks. Uh, I did not do them myself. I had them installed. I do have these curly ends as well that I need to maintenance so that they don't get matted up and tangled. So really all I do is I just go throughout my scalp and make sure that my scalp is clean. I don't wash my hair with these locks in. I just simply clean my scalp. I just clean it whenever it feels dirty or when I feel like I have product buildup. Um, and if I have any dandruff or anything, I like to clean that off first before I start putting... Um, anything into my hair so from scalp maintenance i just use the instant soothe scalp elixir it has cooling menthol and peppermint oil in it to relieve itchy and dry scalp and it's no rinse you can use it as many times a day as you need to if your scalp is like burning itching this is great for that it has a little spray pump at the top and you're just going to spray that onto your scalp and then you'll just rub that in. This has a very tingling and soothing sensation. So it's just gonna help to soothe that itchy dry scalp. So after I use the scalp elixir, I'm gonna go in with the daily moisture cream and this is just going to help to uh, moisturize my scalp after using the elixir. So we're going to take the cream and just apply that to the scalp to make sure that everything is Moisturize, and I love that the bottle comes with this nozzle so that you can get in between and massage that in. It doesn't really matter if you do this process day or night. I prefer to do it um, in the daytime just because I'm more awake. It also works at nighttime, especially um, because you know while you're going to sleep, it sinks into your scalp and you can wake up and just be gone and do what you gotta do, you know what I'm saying? Uh, if you don't have a lot of time in the morning to do all of this. But I like to take my time and just massage my scalp just to make sure that everything sinks in well. Once I've done that, I'm pretty much done. Then all I do with the ends is I just wet them. Just take a spray bottle and wet the ends of your hair if they tend to be a little scraggly. I just spray the ends and I wear this thick robe because it acts as like a towel <laughs> so that I don't get water everywhere. Um, on my clothes and stuff, but you probably want to do this with a robe or a towel around you just to make sure they're not tangled or anything, get any shedding out, um, and just scrunch up and dry the ends a little bit just to give it a nice and tousled look. Of course, you don't have to lay your edges if you don't want to. Typically, I really don't have to, and I've, I've noticed that my hair looks good with or without laying my edges. If you feel so inclined, you can take some edge control and swirl your edges, do what you want with them. I'm just using um, this brush. This brush is by Baby Tress. Boom. And that is it for my faux locks. That is how I maintain my faux locks, how I keep them looking cute, even with the, you know, untamed wild look that they have i still like to maintain my hair literally all i care about is my scalp when i wear these full locks so it's imperative that i keep my scalp moisturized itch free flake free and i do that with the products that i use so be sure to check out the description box for more information about the head and shoulders royal oils the royal oils collection is available at 
family dollar so be sure to check that out i will talk to you guys in my next video if you have any questions please let me know but other than that i will see you guys soon okay